I was a little kid, my mom gave me a chemistry set and I mixed some chemicals and made a little explosion in her, <laughs> on her rug and that got me like, wow, that's, that's pretty cool, so I became a chemistry major. But in general, I think, you know, as a civilization, we have become a, uh, uh, we, we become users of the technology, we don't understand it. You know, people have iPods and iPhones and all this technology in their hands. They know how to tweet and Twitter and do all this stuff, but you know, there's mechanical engineering, material science engineering, polymer engineering, all these types of technology that's in there. And I think if, if you know, students and, and, and people in general want to know more about how to make that and develop that, then they will not only get paid, but they will help advance the technology further. So instead of just being users of the technology, understand it and be developers and, and makers of the technology. And, th and this technology can help save people's lives. It can help, you know, better, um, you know, better make our, our, our way of life on the planet you know, much more positive. The other thing, and it, it, it's basically science is fun just because you learn, you, you learn how things work and why things work and you can build new things. And that's just so exciting. And the other thing is, even if you study science and choose not to have it as a career, or study engineering and choose not to have it as a career, you have learned through the process of studying those fields how to take big, complex, almost unsolvable problems and break them down into piece parts and attack each piece part, and then you can solve a whole bigger problem. So you learn that way of thinking. And I think that's critical for everybody to have that skill, whether, it, and you can apply it to, you know, how do I buy a house or, or, you know, a hurricane comes and knocks my house over, how do I put it back together again? I mean, you get into these very complex problems through your whole life, and they can be very overwhelming, but if you've gone through this process of learning science and engineering and about how we approach problems, you can take that methodology and use it everywhere in your life. Welcome, Welcome to, to Talking, Talking Science. science. Talk, Talk science, science to me. me.